You know, I love technology. To me, it's really how we can use technology to rent more space, right? I think it was um, George Carlin. And in one of his skits, he said, the meaning of life is to find out where we store our stuff, right? <laughs> so, so I, I kind of like how it, can we take technology to help operators rent more space. The recent release last, in the last couple of years of the IOE platform, which really contains CIA at the moment, has gone off unbelievably uh, fast. CIA is just taking off like wildfire. Uh, in my 40 years in software and services, I have never seen a product come out that quickly, that good, without with so few issues. And I came in a little naive. The idea that the industry didn't already have, a, have an app that automatically opens the gate when somebody drives up to it, if the tenant has Storage Genie app on their phone and they drive up to the keypad, the phone will talk to the keypad, the gate will open up. They don't have to stop and pull the phone out of their pocket and unlock their phone and find an app and click a button. We want to show them the advantage of not being able to get out of the car in the pouring rain and not having to try to remember their code and what unit number. And so with the app, it's really easy. They just roll up open the app and they gain entry. For us, that's a huge selling point. It gives us the competitive edge because at the other sites who are not using CIA, they're having to get out of their car, put in their code. Sometimes the keypad's on the other side and you know this back and forth and trying to get close to it thing without hitting the bollard. So um, with us, it's just really simple and it's really just all about customer satisfaction. Today, we're, you know, the, the hot thing I think on the market has been um, securing each unit door at a facility. Um, and I think it's because there's been some great marketing done for it. I think the jury's still out on whether if a customer will really pay more for an electronic lock. My opinion, I don't think that'll happen. So we're really focused on the uh, operation side. And our, our, our vision is that it's really not about the unit lock. It's really about um, the, the control of it. So we have working on three different prototypes for locking doors in different ways because we don't think there's one size that fits all. So the two things that we think locks on units can do is one is you can secure an empty unit until you have someone that wants to come rent it. And instead of having the manager be present and have to take the manager lock off an empty unit, um, have an electronic lock there allows you to rent a unit online, over the phone, at a kiosk, anywhere you want, and then the tenant come at their, at their leisure and move into the unit. Today we were over at Lisa's property and they had green locks on all of the units, right? All of the units that weren't rented. So they can only really rent units during office hour when a manager there can physically take it out. So with an electronic unit lock, you're open 24 hours. We all know now that this is not an eight to five society. Banks have proved that years ago with ATMs. So that really opens up the opportunity to drive more revenue and be more convenient for the customer. But the second one is the overlock process. So I, I believe the industry average is somewhere around eight to 10% of units get overlocked because the tenant doesn't pay on time. And if that's a 500 unit facility, you're talking about 50 units that a manager is out there putting overlocks on and then you have to go take them off because a big a majority of those people actually pay. And so when they pay, the tenant expects to get in the unit, so the manager has to go take that lock off. So the overlock process, process is very expensive for the operator, time consuming, and it's a big friction for the, for the tenant himself. Because now if they rent in the middle of the night or pay in the middle of the night, they can't access the facility. So by electronically locking that, you, you can remove that pain point. And so by having an electronic lock on there, you can just secure the lock so the tenant can't get in if they haven't paid, allow them to pay online, over the phone, however you want to do it, drop a check off at the, at the counter, and instantly they can get into their unit. Well, what it has done is saved us having skips. So no longer will people skip out when owing us rent because we're able to lock their gate code out.